Hey everyone, welcome back to Pop Culturally Challenged. My name is David. This is my beautiful wife, Tony. Hello. And today we're going to be watching The Rocketeer from 1991. What do you know about it? I think this is a Disney movie, which I'm super excited about. Mm -hmm. It was made by Disney. Yeah, so it should be happy. I don't know. <laughs> the, the, so what, what kind of movie are you expecting are you expecting like romance action horror what are you expecting um action okay um since it's rocketeer i'm assuming it's a rocket of some sort and it's animated i don't know okay well cool so you're pretty much going in blind then yeah. <laughs> <laughs> am okay. i wrong like way off it is not animated. I'll say that. Oh. It's a live action. Okay. Um, I'm not going to say anything else. Is it funny? Is it fun? I enjoy this movie. Now, it wasn't super popular when it came out. Um, I remember it when it came out. I saw it at theaters. I really enjoyed it. I think now it kind of has like a cult following. Like, I've actually heard rumors that they're going to be rebooting this and remaking it today. Oh, cool. Um, okay. But, but I don't know if that's like... For sure going to happen or what, but I've, I've heard that kind of like a rumor all the time that there's just this group of people who love this movie. And Is it about a rocket? Like a human rocket or something? You'll see. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Well, I guess let's, uh, let's get into it. You Sounds ready? Great, yes. Okay. Well, if you enjoyed this reaction, please give us a, a thumbs up. Uh, comment down below. Let us know what you think of the Rocketeer. Um, did you see it in theaters? Uh, are you hoping that they remake it? Uh, let us know. Subscribe if you're not, and if you'd like to check out our full-length reactions to this and everything else that we've watched on the channel, we have a Patreon. We'll link that down below. And on that note, on with the show. It's Walt Disney. I don't. I can't see me having to cry or wanting to cry. The music is very sweet, but that's what I said about Forrest Gump. So, um, I don't trust my instincts anymore. <laughs> Babe, just let go and enjoy the movie. That's the best advice I'm going to give to you on this one. Okay. That's fresh paint, damn it. You want me to crash? You treat her nice, Clifford. She's going to take us all the way to the National. Oh, Lord. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing about that seems safe. <laughs> but I guess before you had to like crank the cars too, right? Yeah. So I heard people used to actually break their arms because the thing would spin and like oh, break wow. their arm. I don't know how true that is. I mean, he's so close to the glass. It seems like if he was to like bump into something, you know, if he, when he's landing, he's going to like break his teeth or something. <laughs> I think he's a stunt pilot or a, you know, air show pilot or something. <laughs> Whoa. Gosh. <that's> a... <laughs> he's so low. Yeah. The 1938. Those cars are so cool. I love the cars in the 30s. They had so much character. No air conditioning, uncomfortable to drive, but... <laughs> that seat, that rumble seat. <gasps> wow. Oh, crap. Why, what? Oh my gosh, why are they shooting at the plane? I don't know. I guess they think he, he's with the cops or something. Oh no. That can't be good. Oh. Oh, no. oh wow. <gasps> Whoa! Oh. <laughs> Why did he go higher? I've heard that like if you're having engine problems, you want to get higher so you can glide longer if you have to. Some main ride. You think? Right. Ladies and gentlemen, Captain Obvious. <laughs> He's getting away! Whoa. 
They bring the fire extinguishers. They're gonna have to. Yeah, how's he oh gonna get God. out? Oh, that's your girlfriend. <laughs> no offense, Pop. But uh, we got more important things to do than get all sweaty about whose fault it was. We made a living with that plane. Well, maybe it's time to get a real job. That flyboy hangs around my kids and you let him walk? Maybe you had it coming. <laughs> Take a look at this. Hey, that must be the gizmo, all right. Well, yes, it could have been worse. They chased it to an airstrip in the valley. There was a wreck on the runway. The X-3 was destroyed. How soon can you rebuild it? Not a chance. I'm sorry I ever dreamed the damn thing up. What do we tell the president? Tell him the dream is over. Tell him Howard Hughes said so. <laughs> Where are we going to get this kind of dough, Bigelow? we got to sell a GB for scrap. I hate to kick you when you're down. But business is business. Of course, I uh, could always use the old clown act. We don't do the clown act no more. It's worth 15 bucks a shot. 10 bucks a shot, 5 bucks goes towards your bill. First show's at nine. Don't be late. Clown suit. <laughs> Clown act. Good thinking, Clifford. You just sent us back about four years. Number five pissed me a shot. Nothing left of her but spit and bailing wire. I could fly a shoebox if it had wing speed. So that's why we're watching this movie. <laughs> I see how you are. It's my duffel bag. Here, Pete. Clean that paper. I wondered how long it would be before you said something about that. <laughs> <laughs> kind of looks like the vacuum cleaner. <laughs> when they get it back to the government, they're going to realize they've got the wrong thing, right? I don't know. I wouldn't touch that if I were you. <gasps> okay, they broke it. Yeah. <laughs> for that. What's the damn thing for? Hold it. He can't fly with that. It's going to burn his behind. <laughs> Stealing, what the heck? Stealing the statue from the flight school. Why? I don't know. Now what went wrong? What went wrong? This was supposed to be a simple snatch and grab. I didn't say to be simple, Eddie. And snatch and grabs that you're supposed to be good at. Now, where's the package? Nothing's going to happen with me and my boys until you tell me exactly why this merchandise is so important to the Fed. Let's get out of here, boys. It's a rocket. Like in the comic books. Darn, I didn't read comic books. <laughs> You don't need my services anymore. And I'll tell you what, you pay me what you owe me because you're half a lunatic anyhow. <laughs> I want that rocket, Eddie. Not next week, not tomorrow. Now. And I'll double your price. You'll triple my price. Whoa. He did just have a sword to his neck. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, are they going to see if it burns his butt? <laughs> see? It's got to burn his butt. Don't worry about it. He's got fireproof pants. Oh, he does? Just go with that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop. Stop. Oh, Lord. They lost it now. Yeah. <laughs> So much for that. <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, I guess give me the clown suit. Yep. Movie's over. Oh. Oh. Is it coming back to him? Really? Looks like a firefly. <laughs> Boy, I must have woke up the whole valley. 
Pick her up. Come on, let's get out of here. You'd pay to see a man fly, wouldn't you? Ah! I don't want to keep it. I, I just want to borrow it for a while. When you borrow something, you don't tell nobody. They call that stealing, you know. <laughs> but they didn't steal it because it was in their plane. Yeah. Of course. Whose is it? What? Yours. <laughs> it beeps his gum everywhere. Hey, we better scram if we're gonna catch this Cagney movie. Uh, 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 it's my turn to pick. Uh-oh. This new Neville Sinclair movie. Oh, Jen, you know Cagney's better. What are you talking about? The movie, Wings of Honor. Neville Sinclair? Uh-huh. This I gotta see. He looks scary. Yeah. <laughs> What's the idea of missing an arm like this? We not want... He's really scary looking. Who's there? Who is it? Imagine waking up to that in your face. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> the rocket. I don't answer to nobody but Eddie Valentine. Uh -huh. Okay, okay, okay. I got the package stashed real good. It's at the airfield. <laughs> it really settles down. No <laughs> <laughs> wow, he didn't see the shoes right there? Yes, not. Bulldog Cafe. At the end of the movie, he flies over the enemy trenches and he drops a bottle of champagne. It was symbolic. He was being chivalrous. Where'd he get the champagne? Yeah. That's not the point. It's just Malcolm, hmm? the wheel came off. Yeah, sure. Sure, we'll fix her up. Did I ever tell you about the time I got shot down by the Red Baron? Hmm? No? <laughs> no. He comes screaming out of the sun, guns blazing, and then smack. <gasps> oh. I'm sorry, <laughs> Jenny. Oh, it's okay, Malcolm. Is she still going to eat the soup? Mm -hmm. We'll go out and have a real night on the town. After you win the Nationals. You're going to fly in the Nationals after all? Well, I'm glad to hear it. After the landing today. How about a warm-up, Malcolm? Huh? You said there were a few bumps. I thought old Clippy's number was up. What with the fire and all. <laughs> when something goes wrong, I should be the first one to know about it. I shouldn't be the last. Jan, everyone knows because they were at the airfield. I had an audition. Just like the last time when I flew the regional. See, she's not supportive. No. Well, go after her, you dope. And takes his hamburger. <laughs> yeah. I'm not, gonna, I'm not gonna stop eating. Well, you have a good time? I just can't figure this girl out. You got a good thing going on with that girl, Clifford. But if she flies a coop, I'm telling you right now, it's gonna be your fault. <laughs> Prepare to die that we may learn the identity of the laughing bandit. Wait, wait. Now this reminds me of Zorro the Gay Blade. <laughs> <laughs> I think they're ripping off Robin Hood. Oh my God! Would that be drink of my lips as deeply? God, God, God! They can't just insert the scene with her saying that. They have to do the entire scene again. Laughing Bandit. Now that's a movie I'd like to watch. For the channel, yeah. Is he going to get in the scene by accident? <gasps> oh! 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 <laughs> Never let it be said Neville Sinclair failed to bring down the house. Charlie's been stabbed. I had no idea. Did you think I was stealing the scene? Don't talk. <laughs> Don't even move. This is supposed to be a closed set. No visitors. Jenny, banned from the lock. Something really big is happening. I want you to be the first to know. What do you mean you found something? <laughs> it's an engine. Okay. What's this? Pay voucher. The director wants you off the picture. You know this is a closed set. <laughs> Here comes Hello. the charm. 
I'm Neville Sinclair. I've got a regular table at the South Seas Club if you're not too bored with the South Seas Club. <laughs> you're not too bored with it. We have cost you about 192 miles per hour. They're racing planes? Guess so. Just an air show. There goes the plane. Thanks a lot, Bigelow. I'm two minutes late. Who'd you put up in this Mabel? There's got to be Malcolm up there. Uh, PB hasn't been behind the stick in 25 years. Uh -huh. <laughs> Please tell me that this is not going to be sad and he's going to die. I don't know. Oh, no. I reworked the throttle to just squeeze her like a gas pedal. Anything else? Yeah. Ow. A little luck. <laughs> oh, that looked like a dirty finger, though. Yeah. <laughs> How do I look? Like a hood ornament. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh! Oh! Oh, oh no. crap! <laughs> Wake up, Malcolm! Come on! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! It's all part of the show. Okay, he's gonna save him, right? <laughs> Why doesn't he hold on to the railing for the wheels or something? I don't know. Get out of here. Oh no, another <laughs> gas truck. <laughs> <laughs> Look at me. I did it. <laughs> Where is everybody going? My guess would be the telephones. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oi. Oh no. <laughs> Big gopher. Big gopher. <laughs> Oh, that was a soft landing. Sort of. Softer than... <laughs> At least his face seemed to stop it all. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> Oh, go, oh, go, go, run, 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 go. News, boys. Okay, come on. Is it gonna start? Oh no, it's not gonna start. Here's zero, push. <laughs> <laughs> that was smart, though. That yeah. was super smart. Congratulations, gentlemen. Thanks to the diligence of the FBI, this particular vacuum cleaner <laughs> will not fall into the wrong hands. <laughs> I'm surprised it took him that long to figure it out. Yeah. Oh, somebody rang second. Day off. Somebody's been looking for something. Oh, oh Man. no. It's folded in half. Oh God, that's his He's foot. <laughs> something. Sixteen thirty-five. Bomb terrorists. Oh no, they sent the scary man. Yeah. Oh Where? no, please don't tell me they're gonna kill him. Honey, it just started. That's a huge hand. Yeah. Kick it in, kick it in. Oh, he's scary. It's huge. <laughs> Thankfully, there's no beam there. Oh. Oh my god, there's two other people in there. Yeah, you don't even know what you're shooting at. Oh, stay down. 
Stay down. Stay down. Yeah, stay down. <laughs> He's worried about his hat. <laughs> Nobody's covering the back door. Apparently not. They were pretty destructive. Very. That's a far cry from that bulldog cafe. <laughs> Okay, do you, I need to get some tissue for you? Because you're going to start drooling, I'm sure. Over that? <laughs> Here, oh. honey. You don't want to get wet. <laughs> I'm good. Thank you, though. Well, let me introduce you, Mr. Jenny Blake. Oh, charms, my dear. <laughs> <laughs> Doubly charmed. Uh, Jenny, excuse me for a moment. Bill, please I thought you'd never ask. Scram. Scram. <laughs> <laughs> PB, the FBI is going to lock us up. Between the FBI and that King Kong gentleman, we're going to get ourselves killed over this thing. We just come from the airfield. It's a big They killed him. What the heck? Why do they come in packs? Like, do people think they're not going to be noticed? I don't think they care if they get noticed. We're looking for a pilot by the name of uh, Cliff Secord. I hadn't seen him around. Your name was Cincinnati. <laughs> if you boys aren't ordering, I'm going to have to ask you to leave. I don't like music while I'm digesting. Oh my gosh. We told you, we don't know where he is. Maybe we can refresh him from there, huh? Talk, Dad, or get a facial. Drop dead, you weasel. Uh-huh. <gasps> oh, my God. Oh, my God. Mm. Ah, hold it. Ah. Jenny. Looky here, boys. Was that really her phone number? Uh-huh. Hello? Hello. This is the uh, florist. I've got a lovely bouquet of flowers here for... Uh, who sent a flower? Cliff Secord. Well, tell him he's too late because she's gone to the South Seas Club with Mr. Neville Sinclair. <laughs> oh, you got more than I bargained for to that. Hey! It's Mr. Ketchup Bottle! <laughs> oh, they've never met Jenny. <laughs> the pans always work. Claire? No! Please, I'm sorry. I should have listened to you from the start. But Jenny's in trouble now. You promised me one thing. When she's safe, this thing goes back. Brother, you got my word on it. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You're leaking like a sieve here. You must have picked up a ricochet. If you did that button, we'd be all over the map by now. Gee, her luck's still holding. Stand clear. What was that? Poor <laughs> Pete. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> Here's to you, and the extraordinary way your face catches the light. He's so smooth. <laughs> and someone so jealous. No. 30 years ago, yeah, before I met you, I would have been, but now... I mean, he's like pulling out all the stops. <laughs> Clears the entire dance floor. <laughs> I still don't hear any music. Yeah. Hmm, oh, there's music. Why didn't he just go in the front door? Or uh -huh. the back door? Oh look, he's got this giant package with him. He's not exactly dressed for the South Seas Club. Everybody's like in tuxedos and... Good point. Oh, but look, he's come across some uniforms. He's still got his jacket underneath uh -huh. it. <laughs> what happened? Uh, we didn't order anything. Uh, yes, sir. He was uh, a fan of yours. Sent some soup over. I don't know why the real pilots even let him fly. At least I'm beginning to feel a bit better about the competition. <laughs> <laughs> you worked here long. Oh, yes. I waited on you last time. <laughs> <laughs> Will you just excuse me for a minute? No, please, stay. No, no, no sit down. Don't worry about it, Nev. I'll be right back. Dang it! <laughs> Remember at the studio what I told you about the rocket we found? Well, the people that are looking for it murdered Bigelow to get to me. And now they're after you. Jenny, prepare yourself for a shock. I'm the rocketeer. The rocket who? 
I want you to get in a cab right now, go to your mom's in Redlands, and stay there until you hear from me, okay? Give me one good reason why I should believe any of this. Because if anything ever happened to you, I'd go out of my mind. I swear I would. Oh. <laughs> oh, here you go, baby. Get romance? <laughs> With your girlfriend. Oh, God. <laughs> Stomping in. <laughs> Oh, Lord. <laughs> He's not going to be able to get to the rocket very easily. Oh, they're going to catch up to him. Oh, Lord. Jenny, go. What is she doing? <laughs> oh, it was ice. Yeah. Oh, no. She's going to get caught. Yep. Mm hmm. Brings drinks in. Welcome to my home. I wouldn't be drinking that. Yeah. You kidnapped me. Against my will, believe me. These are brutal, ruthless men, Jenny. No, I'm scared. Oh, sir, sir, sir. <laughs> Into a leading lady, clay in the hands of the master sculptor. Moonlight on Broadway, the scene on the top of the Empire State Building. <laughs> Can't be comfortable in that gown. I think you've seen a lot of movies. <laughs> I would say um, he's she's a fan. Yeah. You're beautiful. Do you want me to try this out? Desperately. <laughs> please can you help me I finally played a scene with Neville Sinclair <laughs> is he back at that no, I... restaurant I think so everybody's gone hey, ah! oh. oh shit Talk to your girlfriend? Lots of luck. Stay out of town by now. Chris, is that you? You want to see your girlfriend? You got to bring us the rocket. Write this down. And come alone. Oh, we're going to have to kill a girl. Chris, what's happening? What are they doing to Jenny? Quiet, Patsy. I got to think. I recognize her, too. Freeze! FBI! Remember me? <laughs> All I did was bypass the pressure valve, and that solved your throttle problem. Nothing to it, Howard. Just basic aviation. She's only head on. No sign of the rocket. You know who I am? What pilot does it, Mr. Hughes? I designed the Cirrus X-3. It was stolen from my factory. I didn't take it. Clifford, I told him everything that happened, and he believed it. Give the man his rocket. Can't do that. Not yet. Secord, I don't think you know the game you're playing. The German prototype had the same problem as our first design. Keep watching, kid. Cost a man's life to get this out of Germany. Well, they have that right. Mm -hmm. Where's my rocket pack, Secord? Look, they got my girl. Ah. Oh, God, Cliff, no. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they set up a rendezvous. They want to swap Jenny for the rocket. Look, kid, I understand how you feel, but you've got to let us handle this. i got to go alone, or they're going to kill her. We'll take it from here, Mr. Hughes. Let's go, kid. Hey! Just, 
and just glided. And it keeps on gliding. A son of a bitch will fly. I think that was a spruce goose. I don't know that. Ever, uh, I don't know much about it, but I think it was a plane that never never got built, or it was like gigantic or something. Take the rocket off. First, you let her go. Ah! Dang it! <laughs> What's it like working for a Nazi, Eddie? What's he talking about? Nazi spy ring, flying commandos, or work? Ask me about the Germans on the radio. Relax, Frankenstein. You ain't bulletproof. I'm paying you well. Does it matter who I work for? It matters to me. I may not make an honest buck, but I'm 100% American. Let it go. Oh, didn't wow. see that coming, did you, Cliff? <laughs> I didn't see that coming. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What the heck is that? That blimp. Remember the German blimp they showed? This is the FBI! Throw down your guns! It's the fans who came... He was riding that guy. <laughs> oh. <laughs> but Jenny. Hey. He left Jenny. He's going to go back. She's not fighting back very much. Yeah. How in the world are they going to get her up there? Either go or I'll throw you off. <laughs> hey, I'm going to see me. Where's the rocket? We've got the girl. The rocket will come to us. Oh, mm. okay. Wish they would tell us what they're saying. Oh, oh man. Oh man. Is he gonna fall down? Oh no. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> he just carries this huge wrench with him at all times. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Pilot is the finest in Germany. He will not let us down. <laughs> <laughs> now we're screwed. <laughs> oh, that was good. <laughs> we are losing altitude. We must drop some weight. We are losing altitude. <laughs> Hand over the rocket or I'll blow her brains. It's not going to work without the helmet, right? We won't be able to control the flight, but it'll still work. Oh, the leak. Yeah. So he's going to try to fly it. I don't know. He's going to have to tr he's going to try to save himself cuz he's a coward. Where's your stunt man now, Sinclair? <laughs> I do my own stunt. <laughs> oh no oh he hit his head yeah oh no oh no stop oh 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 those windows seem awfully yeah. cheap <laughs> <laughs> yeah yeah oh no and now we have a problem yeah <laughs> i have a second ticket Everything about you is a lie. It wasn't lies, it was acting. <laughs> <laughs> that's funny. Yeah, that's why it only says Hollywood now. How are they gonna get down? Uh oh. We came back. Why won't you die? <laughs> Howard, we're only going to get one pass at this. 
They're not going to be able to catch him on that plane. <laughs> Are they going to... Okay, go, 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 go. That's a lot of fire. Yeah. Film fans were saddened by the news. Neville Sinclair was killed in the tragedy when flaming debris fell on his touring car. <laughs> She's a beauty, Mr. Hughes. <laughs> it's named GB. Would you excuse us for just a moment? Of course. I've been meaning to ask you, what was it like? Strapping that thing to your back and flying like a bat out of hell. It was the closest I'll ever get to heaven, Mr. Hughes. Maybe not. Be around, Rocketeer. <laughs> Don't ever fly her without this. Wow. I have something for you, too. Actually, it's for Peavy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what was that line again? Would that you drink with my lips. Thanks. I don't mind if I do. Clifford, take a look at this here. Hey, Goose, you want to take a, take a look at this? <laughs> I guess you're not really interested, are you, Cliff? Hmm. All right, so that was The Rocketeer. What did you think? That was a great movie. It was lighthearted and yeah. fun. And it was good. The, there was only one bad thing. I'm pretty sure I can guess, but what what would that be? <laughs> <laughs> if your girlfriend wasn't in the movie, oh, it would have been a perfect movie. Oh, okay. My girlfriend, okay. <laughs> well, it was, when, it was great. When I was 19 when this came out, yeah, I probably uh, <laughs> probably did have a massive crush on her. There you go. So, but it's 32 years later, so. Okay. Yeah. So, did you was it what you what you expected? I mean, you, you weren't sure going in. You thought rockets and all that stuff. Yeah, no. It was kind of like an early attempt at a superhero movie. Sure. And, you know, at the time, I mean, when this came out, I think only like you'd had like the Superman from the 70s, the late 70s. You had Batman. But superhero movies weren't really a big thing back then. So this was kind of ahead of its time. Sure. I kind of thought it was an animated movie. Mm -hmm. um, and I pictured like a little robot that could fly, but mm -hmm. I didn't. I mean, obviously it was a man that could fly, which is kind of cool. But and I guess he did look like a little robot when he put on the helmet. Yeah, when he so. had the helmet on. I, I loved the uh, the styling of it, you know, like I, I don't know what it was that he made the helmet out of. He was sawing in half. It looked like uh, a heater. Yeah, it might like have been a, a heater, heater. It, but it had like that 40s, you know, 30s art deco style mm -hmm. to it. It just everything looked cool. Um, you know, there, there were some little in jokes, you know, like Hollywood land. That it used to the sign used to say Hollywood Land. I don't know why they really took the land part out, but you know it was kind of cool. You know, cry. You know, the blimp took it out, or and the plane that he like glided out on. I think it was called the Spruce Goose. I don't know a lot about it. I think it was like gonna be made out of wood or something mm. and it I, I don't know that it was ever made mm -hmm. but that's what the joke was it, it will fly you know uh, so there are little jokes like that um it was a great movie i really enjoyed it i'm thankful that it wasn't um ugly crying kind of movie no it, it wasn't was, a sad movie i mean it had yeah. a little romance i, I figured yeah. you might like it was um, fun yeah the uh it was a happy movie. It was good. Yeah. We finally got one that you didn't yeah. cry, that you enjoyed, that you just smiled at. So. Yeah. Thank you. Next up, I don't know. We'll have to find something uh, <laughs> horrifying or <laughs> sad or something. But yeah, it. I've always enjoyed it. I'm, I'm kind of bummed that it didn't do better because, we, you know, it, it never turned into a series or anything like that. But like I said, they're talking about rebooting it now. And, mm -hmm. and I don't know if it's going to be a reboot or if they're going to have some of the original cast back or all of the original you cast back. You just want to see your I girlfriend in there. <sighs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I know the the um, the older guy is still alive. So mm. I, I don't. It was a great movie. I really enjoyed that. Thank you. Okay. That's it. That's 
Now I can uh-huh. say I saw it. Yeah, you can say you've seen the Rocketeer. Mm-hmm. So. All right. Well, if you enjoyed our reaction, give us a thumbs up. Comment down below. What did you think of this movie? Uh, subscribe if you're not. And if you want to check out our full-length reaction on our Patreon, we'll leave the link down below. And we will see you next time. Bye. Bye-bye.